The Queen's art collection now, moving on, is being woke tested, apparently, so as not to offend snowflakes. So curators reviewing pieces relating to race, enslavement, empire and disability amid increasing objections to the royal family's past. So they're kind of sanitising it in a way. The Royal Collection Trust, which is undertaking the ongoing review, has not revealed exactly how many failed the woke test, but they include a portrait of, get this, Sir Thomas Picton, dubbed the hero of Waterloo, which has had his links to the slave trade, OK, added to the description. The text for a 17th century sketch by Italian artist Dominicio, which someone should have told me how to say before this, to be fair, but uh, there we go. I'm not renowned for my international pronunciation, but uh, it was also changed from epileptic boy to boy with epilepsy. So I think epileptics everywhere will be grateful for that, will they? Uh, up to 1,500 British Empire-themed photos from Edward, Prince of Wales's trip to India in 1921 have been updated to avoid causing offence, as have those from young King George V's world tour on HMS Bacchante in 1881. Well, you may say now, of course, that, that this is all a bit ridiculous, and I personally think it is, but make sure that you get in touch.